G'day guys, Jordan here from East Coast Espresso in Brunswick East in the very cold weathers of Melbourne. Behind me is the Mercury Nero Brew Hub and this is the Steam Hub. We want to showcase some of the features that the Brew Hub has. Firstly, it's a three group coffee machine with individual boilers and a dedicated hot water boiler. That means you can dial in the temperature for the hot water as well as three brew heads. The Steam Hub is an individual vertical boiler and also comes with two steam ones on each one. The vertical boiler technology is absolutely amazing for your texturing of milk. Okay, so let's go through some of the features on the Mercury Nero Brew Hub. Uh, this is the shot screen um, that you'll see as the home screen. Uh, this is the single shot, double shot infinity, so continuous. You also have single restrictor and double restrictor, which also can be programmed for, for flushing. Uh, the settings or the menu buttons up here. The first one is the reporting. So you can go through and press the single shot and the double shot. Let's press the double shot and you can see the last 300 shots and also the average of the last 25 shots. The count will show you the count for the day. So you've got 13 uh, double shots on group head one, 16 on group head two and three on group head three. This is a good indicator to show you how many coffees are being made through each group head so that you can change up between which group head you want to use. The weekly count also shows how many coffees you made for that day. This being the uh, workshop coffee machine, obviously. Other features include for the settings. So you've got the boiler control where you can, de uh, you can dial in the temperature for each boiler and also the hot water boiler. Uh, target controls also include the pre infuse, so zero seconds, so you can change it to five or three, and not 50, 30. You, know. uh, you can change it to two seconds pre infuse, and it's it's separate for each uh, for each group head. Uh, the volumetric controls um, is where you dial in uh, the volumes. So for single shot, it's 140. That is. 140 divided by two, which is the amount of mil. So each unit is actually half a mil. Uh, you've got the shot time targets. This one here allows you to set the recipe. So if you want 20 seconds for a single shot and 30 seconds for a double shot, 20 seconds for a single ristretto and double, uh, 20 seconds for a double ristretto. You'll see those numbers come up here. So that last one was a double shot and you were seven seconds off. So then you have the uh, cleaning function, which shows you how clean the group head is. If this machine, uh, if this group head is cleaned every day um, and there's over 20 coffees made, then it requires a clean. If it's under 20, we've programmed it so that it doesn't require a clean and will stay at 100%, just in case you come in on a Sunday night and wanna make some coffees for your friends. Uh, the regen button is where you can dump the, uh, the water from the group head and regenerate um, most of that water so that it keeps a, a really good pH for coffee and brewing. This here is the on off and also the sleep cycle. So each group head has its own setting where you can either turn it to sleep or turn it off. Um, at the moment, they're all on. Then you've got the busy mode. Here you can set to single shot or double shot for group head one, two, or three. And what that means is that every time you put the group handle in, it will automatically start brewing a single or double shot, whatever you've set it on, after about 1.5 seconds. This gives you a, a lot more flow in your coffee making process without having to press buttons. These are pretty much all the features um, and all the settings that you can go through. Again, this is the home page and it shows you the brew bar and the brew temperature and also the uh, hot water bar pressure and the hot water temperature. Obviously a little time on there. And also it shows you that the group handle is locked in with that little green light. This is the group head three screen. You'll notice that in the top right hand corner, you've got the hot water button. Group head one and group head three both have the hot water button so that you can program them both to different, um, different times. So if you press the hot water button and turn it off to, uh, press it again to turn it off if you want to turn it off early. To program the hot water, you go into target controls, hot water targets. You'll see that group head one has five seconds and group head three is seven seconds. The other thing I'd like to show you is what the screen looks like for when you're brewing. So if I activate, say, double shot, it'll go through and that will show you what shot you're, what shot you're doing, what target you're aiming for. It also has the hot water button in the top. 
Uh, and it also has a cancel, so you can cancel them. Um, and they are the features of the Brew Hub. This here is the Mercury Nero Steam Hub. It's a dual steam tap uh, vertical boiler system that operates on 15 amps. It has only about three liters of water, but it carries about eight liters of steam. You'll notice that very quickly, there is nothing below the bench and it's fully above bench. Uh, it gives it a lot of versatility in moving around. The on off operation is really simple to use. Even if there's no water in the boiler, it will automatically fill before it starts heating. The manometer indicates the pressure internal to the system. And then you have three indicator lights, one showing that the water is coming in, so the inlet is open, the machine is heating, and a service and error light. This will flash uh, if there's no water coming in um, and there's a blockage in the system suggesting there's no more water. It will also turn off the system if there's no water coming in. The service light will also come on and stay on red. The machine will continue operating, but it will say it requires a service. As you can see, the orange light's coming on, saying on it's heating. Dual steam taps work with uh, just a simple, any direction, um, also locking in. They come in different configurations where you can change the steam tips and the length. These machines can be viewed at our Brunswick East factory. Check out our website for details, and thanks for watching.